Hi boys and girls, how are you all doing? It's another beautiful day here in Langkawi and I am staying at Royal Yacht Hotel and Royal Yacht Hotel has given me their best room. I mean, just look at this room's view. It is absolutely fantastic and stunning. I highly recommend you staying at Royal Yacht in your next trip here in Langkawi. There are so many delicious food in Langkawi. I couldn't even list them all in this video. But don't worry, if you don't know what to eat here in Langkawi, I've got you covered. I am going to bring you to some of the poshest places to eat and dine in Langkawi and also some of the most delicious local delicacy that you can find. I've done my homework so that you don't have to. So I've got you covered on the food side and let's start with breakfast. If you love to have fresh and proper food for a fair price with a smile from the people who made it, then Armani Cafe is the right place for you. Open early in the morning until noon, the food is home cooked and very authentic. I thought I was eating at my next door Malay neighbor house. Stay off the main tourist street where you pay four to five times more for probably not even better quality food you will find here. The cafe is well tucked amongst the guest houses. This cafe has been around for more than 20 years as I found out from the owner himself. They offer a variety of Malay dishes and open for breakfast and lunch. It's a hidden secret no more. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I really enjoy the breakfast here and you're eating breakfast in a kampong village atmosphere which you really don't get in the city anymore and the boss is such a friendly person um, telling me you know the situation COVID here in Langkawi so if you ever want to have good breakfast in Langkawi come to Amani Cafe I highly recommend it is such a tranquil place for breakfast. The breakfasts are delicious and cooked by the boss himself. In this food hunt video, I am aftering that local Langkawi dining experience. Nasi Dagang Pak Malau is an institution on this island and I heard the food is spectacular. But the friendly owner and the view overlooking the rice fields with the highest mountain Gunung Raya on the island in the background is what made it even better. The first thing you'll notice as soon as you arrive is the picture-perfect setting. There are two different areas where you can sit right underneath the thatch roof of the restaurant which is open air or you can grab one of the yellow tables set up right on the edge of the rice field. A table on the edge of the rice field with a view of Gunung Raya is definitely supreme. Nasi Dagang is a Malaysian dish of rice and fish curry that originates from the eastern Malaysian state of Trenganu. The rice is fragrantly cooked with onions, gingers and halba, which in English is called fenugreek. What an interesting place to have lunch. I am basically looking at the paddy fields of Langkawi and having my local nasi dagang. They have fish and they have beef and it also comes with chicken. Yes, thank you. So I'm basically having the perfect lunch with my coffee and looking at this fantastic view of, of the paddy fields of Langkawi. It is absolutely gorgeous here. Oh, mm. it's so juicy. Oh, I can taste the spice. Oh my god. Mm. The curry flavor is super thick and strong, <clears throat> and the spices are like, oh, out of this world. Very nice. I have my little fish. Mmm. Mmm. Very fresh 
And here's the chicken. Mmm. And this is kampung chicken. Very, very organic. I mean, what a view to have lunch, you know? So come to Pak Malau if you want the best nasi dagang and the best view for your lunch here in Langkawi. The semi-circular formation of Thai, the beachside restaurant at the Western Langkawi Resort and Spa, sets guests up for picture square views of the Andaman Sea. The team at Thai go all out to make your dining experience an unforgettable one. Bordered by tropical palms and cooled by drafts from the sea, the setting is casual and warm embracing the mood of its island home. The team at Tide went out of their way to ensure every guest felt pampered and could want for no more. They have shown just what is possible on this magical little island. Anyone looking to impress should be assured that a fine meal can be curated for just about any occasion here. Congrats to the team on a remarkable return to business after the lockdown. Being the largest island in Malaysia, seafood is very much a staple dish in Langkawi. When it comes to seafood restaurants, you will not go wrong with Tio Restaurant. They are arguably one of the most popular seafood restaurants in Langkawi at this very moment. They amassed a steady stream of loyal customers over the years for its consistently delicious seafood dishes. These customers include celebrities like actors, politicians, and YouTuber like myself. If you are a solo traveler like myself, may I recommend their signature dish, which is Gravy Hall Fun. They are very famous for this dish. The restaurant gets very busy during the evening, so come early and reserve your seat. It's coffee and dessert next for me. I finally popped into the famous reopened Arts Cafe in Gua. The original cafe has been around for almost 11 years, but the recent inspiring alteration have created a rather unique venue and the name suits it to a T. Arts Cafe is a relaxing despite from the busy Langkawi Fair Mall where it's located and there is no rush to take your order or give your, your bill. You are welcome to linger and simply relax and reflect on the artist's atmosphere. The well-lit and display works of watercolour, acrylic and mixed-media art pieces are by local Langkawi residential artists. The work are, are unique and available for purchase. And pss, pss, they have the fastest Wi-Fi on the island. So the best thing to do for your dinner is get out of your hotel and come visit the night market in Langkawi. It's full of delicious food, local food. You can only get in here if you're vaccinated and children are not allowed in here. If you have Cancino or Johnson & Johnson, it's 28 days. And if you have Sinovac, Pfizer, AZ, 14 days you have to wait to come in here. So I feel really safe.
Oh yes. Yum, yum, yum. It is very, very good. Two ringgit, my god. It just fried it. Mm. Oh my god. Two, two ringgit, my god. Ah, the chicken is so tasty. Yeah. This is the Langkawi, Langkawi Papam, Apam Bale Viral. Oh, okay. No. It's red thin, but very crispy. But you know so oily. Mm. But very sweet, very sweet. Very good boss. It's good. I'm just having so much fun in this night market. Uh, you really have to come out and taste all the local food. It's absolutely amazing. Hey boys and girls. Those food were so delicious, right? I mean, I actually gained a lot of weight in my trip here in Langkawi because those food are irresistible. And what I like about Langkawi food is the food are all homegrown and all organic. Hope you enjoy all my videos so far and do follow and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!